Hello guys, today I'm going to show you my current Airsoft headgear loadout or kind of kit and everything. So first we got the Matrix Fighter hood with mesh mask integrated into it and everything. Kind of like a ball with cloth kind of style stuff and everything. Not exactly one tires or anything. It doesn't have like cheap protection or anything, but I only wanted the mesh here for my teeth and everything. And also just have like a thin layer here. Just so I can put my cheek on my, um, my gun stock and whatnot. On my airsoft gun when I do get that and everything, or if I'm renting or anything, the rental gun, you know, just an airsoft gun in general, be able to cheek it. And also on my field, they require, um, for anyone under age 18, I'm 14, so I'm gonna have to have um, some full face protection. So it makes sense, you know, cheeks for adolescents and and uh, kids and everything, you know, soccer skin and everything. It is what it is, you know, I can say I'm a man all I want and everything, but you know, biologically, not yet. Yeah, that sounds fucked up, never mind. <laughs> but um, yeah, let's put this on. So this will be my first um <clears throat> the first piece piece of headgear I put on and everything. It um it's pretty, covers your entire head. You have um double layers here by your ears to also kinda help with um, you know, keeping it on you and everything. It's pretty nice, doesn't block your voice at all, very breathable, very comfortable, first off and everything. That the only thing about like having this little like thick layer here, it kinda blocks your pro seal and everything, for, like if you want like, the best or anything, but you can just you know take that off and everything to put it over your so you get like even like you know better ear seal and everything but it's really not that bad but you know if i was going to be in a, a if like if they were like if like the game the you know game announcement announced that people are going to be using grenades frequently in a match i would probably put my ear pro under instead of having it over this but if this works it does work most definitely does work so then what i would do is um my ear pro on so these are my uh this, um, this was 20 bucks or I think, oh, you like everything, we'll have a description, like a link in the description, except he's walking through your pro. <clears throat> the guy used to drag him in. Why well, I had a cough when I'm trying to make a video, DGs. Well, here's here's some Walker's Razor Slims. Got them at Dragomans when I was shooting machine guns there. And um, yeah, they're electronic ear pro. Um, they work and everything very, very well, very, very comfortable, very nice. These are for like, you know, grenades and everything because, you know, they can, it's like Thunder Beast, you know, sound grenades. They can mess up your hearing. But, you know, having these, you know, get your protection just in case you get hit because you know ear lobe shit will hurt but also you get some hearing protection as well which is very nice and also they kind of look cool you know what i mean i mean like come on they look cool man at least i think they look cool so put these bad boys on still even with that little like here and everything it um it's still a good seal but if you want even like better you, know, you can put it like that and uh that's what i might do but um honestly it's not exactly the most ergonomic either and kind of loosens it up so the goggles do keep it on there a little tire which kind of gets past this but um it still keeps it on so turn them on so i'll be able to hear the electronic ear press that amplifies people so if you want the field and you know the announcer says you know blind man or i can hear blind man across the field because it even amplifies the sound but not enough for you know to cause hearing so hearing damage and whatnot so then i have my um i have my matrix ultimate goggle system it comes with um some of the goggles i took out the black ones or anything because i play on um, 4 p.m to 10 p.m sessions on saturdays or i'm more likely going to play and everything is that so i am playing at nighttime so having dark you don't you won't be able to see anything really so i got some clear lenses in here so these are the tan colors same thing with this mesh it's um, all tan some of my camo hat not my, my camo hat the boonie hat it's already bought beforehand or anything it wasn't before airsoft kit, but this kind of goes. I'm not gonna buy another booty head just because, you know what I mean? Take these bad boys out. These cost about 20 bucks here. Um, you know, they're ANSI um, or whatever, rated and everything, so I know I'm not like gonna use my, my eyes or anything. They are rated, you know, properly and everything else from Matrix, kind of trusted brand stuff, so put these bad boys on. All right, and they have like a small gap here and everything. It's kind of depends on kind of how you put them on. These also keep the walkers, um, I've noticed, quite on there quite well. Especially if you put them on like this very, very well. It will keep these, it will keep the walkers on <laughs> and your peg and everything much tighter and uh, stuff. But, you know, I can't get the mic, so I might um, put them, you know, up here. They might look a little bit awkward and everything, just gotta get down and stuff, but you might have a little bit of eyebrows, more like, <laughs> But if you have dark, you know what I mean, it's not gonna come notice that much, but I mean, it is what it is. And then I have my boonie hat, you know, for sun. I might end up getting like an ops core helmet and stuff and everything, for um, airsoft and whatnot. It's kind of, 
Cause vibe. I mean, it'll, it'll look cool and whatnot. But um, yeah, Dooney hat. It's just kind of there for functionality and stuff and whatnot. And kind of tighten it, and bam, they got the complete airsoft kit or anything. A little bit janky, but honestly, I'll you know, I'm also not the ass or anything. I can just run the eye pro and everything. Because by the way, mine is. I like my teeth, so you know, it's so pretty nice. It is definitely so pretty nice. All right, get that going. All right. So yeah, you know, flash, you know, grenade protected and everything, sub protected too, and if you know, it's where you take it off and everything, go like this, kind of look a bit, a bit dumb, I, I will say, a little bit. Or honestly, you could run the ear pro over all this and everything, so like, like another configuration if I want to do is, um, take my, my ear, my eye pro, put that on, how it above so it doesn't mess with the seal, the ear pro, and then put the ear pro on over it. And then bam. But you know, the it gets the way to seal and everything makes it thicker so you can still hear a lot. You just really kind of make things a little bit too loud for my taste and everything, so it kinda of like keep, keep like like a one notch setting. So it only it's only like when you produce a loud noise or anything over ninety decimals where it compresses it completely. And it, you know, it makes sure so you don't get any sore or vertical or anything, don't get the ringing in your ears. Or shooting and everything. Also, I, um, if I'm like really keen on my hearing, I don't really care about communication, I will run the like, earplugs. Like, um, Max earplugs here. I'll go see. Here. Find it here. Oh, there it is. So, so I'll run these, um, Max earplugs or anything. It's a little bit still my desk and everything, but run Max earplugs, just put them in. And 32, 33 decimal blocking. I, I use Max earplugs when I go shooting. Especially if I'm round um, different calibers, like um, like um, rifle rounds and stuff, and shit louder than um, like nine millimeter and things. Especially up close, like just like right by you and stuff. Like especially like, indoor ranges, I will run um, both, like you know, headset ear pro and um, and um, earplugs because it's just a lot better and don't. You know, it's just a lot quieter. I like quiet. You know, I like enjoying I like enjoying shooting when it's quiet. You know. Depends. Depends. Sometimes like loud. You know, sometimes. Because also when I was dragging and shot machine guns, I was on running um, earplugs plus this, but it was turned up a lot higher so I could hear it through my earplugs, but, you know, this is what it is. To hear, like, communication, because I'll be instructed. You know, I'm wearing a shirt and everything, you know, fire fall, machine guns and whatnot, wearing it all. But, um, yeah, that's, that's my headgear set up and everything. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you. Peace.